still in College Park as the Albany Great Danes beat the Terps 11 to 10. I'm Wayne Viner, that's Bruce Posner. Bruce, who's our special guest? Got a special guest, Connor Fields, uh, one of the heroes of the game today. Maybe Jacob Patterson was the hero today with four goals. Uh, tell us what this win means to you and the program. As Coach said, you beat the best team in the country today for the past five years. Yeah, I mean, uh, predominantly they're a great team this year. Uh, we knew we had our hands full. They have a bunch of great players. They have a lot of talent over there. Uh, their defense is definitely very solid. Their offense, they could put the ball in the net. And their face offs are great too. So we knew we knew they were a complete team, and we knew uh, we we're going to bring our A game this today for the win. And we're, we're really, really, really happy we got that win. Ten to six, you're down in the fourth quarter. You know you have TD Earl, and he was kind of 50-50 with -50 was shocky until the end, but. When it mattered, he really came through for you. Yeah, I mean, having a guy like TD, um, he never really gets rattled. He never never really gets in his head. Uh, he was struggling a bit in the beginning of the game, but, uh, I mean, fourth quarter speaks for itself. Six for six, helped us go on our run and uh, helped us win the game. And as we all know, time is money. That's where our fully managed approach to IT can help. With proactive remote monitoring and management, we're able to keep tabs on your IT infrastructure 24-7, 365 days a year. Want to learn more? Drop us a line today to see exactly how we can help keep your systems running smoothly and keep you focused on what matters most, growing your business. You had the assist, you had the goals at six points. What did that defense do to you and how did they try to take you out of your game? Um, they played. They played very physical. Um, I mean, yeah. There's some great. They have some great poles, and uh, individually, they're very good on defense, and they play great team defense. But uh, we kind of saw that they weren't really sliding too much um, from from the crease or anything. They're sliding kind of adjacent. Um, so, so we knew where the looks were, and we knew. Uh, I mean, we knew where we were getting open, and uh, I think we very, utilized picks very well today, and I think that helped us out a lot. Yeah, they frustrated Nanticoke somewhat today, which hasn't happened this year. Uh, anything special they did that you could tell? Uh, I mean, no. Nah. Um, kid who covered him, Bryce, Bryce Young is a great de defender, and uh, uh, Ho I feel like Hogs had a good game. Uh, he had some, he had some chances he could uh, he could have capitalized on. And he had, he, I mean, he had that feed to Jacob Patterson for a nice goal. Um, he he brings a whole another element to our offense, and uh, I mean, maybe stopping him, but it opened up so many other guys just by just by how much they were focusing in on uh, in on uh, the, our attack. So. Um, we feel like that helps us a lot. You know, you, you won the game. You, it was a kind of like a pick em kind of game. But you did something that nobody does. You came into Maryland and won the ground ball war. And you had the biggest one on that last faceoff. Uh, was that a point of emphasis at halftime because you got slaughtered in the first half? Yeah, first half we weren't really picking up ground balls. And uh, we feel like that's one of the strong points of our team. Uh, with two middies and attack. We were, we were usually very good on ground balls. And came out in the second half. Coach talked to us about it a little bit in the locker room. We came out. And we feel like we, we got we got the majority of the ground balls, and uh, that definitely helped us go on there. Wayne, one more, and then we'll let him go. Well, I got two more. But All right. <laughs> one, one game one. Uh, I'll skip that. We have a couple questions that we usually ask guys, so we don't get to interview a lot. Uh, okay. Bruce has these memorized. I'm going to start with, what's your favorite kind of car? Car? Car. Um, I like the Range Rover. Right. Yeah, it's cool. I like seeing those while drive around. It's my dream to have one of those. All right. First concert you ever saw? First concert, oh, um, Bon Jovi with my parents, yeah. And what uh, was yeah. that? Um, that was in Pittsburgh. Okay. Yeah, so it was, it was a little drive, but uh, parents that listened to Bon Jovi, and they, they drove me and my brother up there when we were young, and it was a good concert. Greatest piece of advice you've ever been given? Um, Coach Coach Marr, definitely just always, just seeing him, always positive attitude, positive effort. Um, just say, keeping a positive mentality, I think, is huge in life. And uh, I mean, you're gonna have you're gonna have ruts, you're gonna have your downs, but uh, if you stay positive, uh, it'll get better. Congratulations, a great win. I hope we see you in the final four, my friend. Thank yeah. you. Thank All right, you. It, yeah. be a great rematch. Thank you. All right. We'll certainly Thank see you at the Torton Award. This <laughs> <time>. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. All right. All right. Thanks, Connor. Thank you. All right.